So what now, Miss Sauvé? Pregnancy yoga, Lamaze class? Make a doctor's appointment? At this point, the health of the baby is paramount. So who knows? Only my brother and Toby. Not your parents? Liberty, you're six months pregnant. I know, Miss Sauvé. But my father, there's no way I can tell him. So you've just been hiding it? Well, let's talk about options. It's a little late in the game for an abortion, so I assume that's off the table? Absolutely. I want to carry this baby to term, but afterwards... Liberty, there is no afterwards, okay? What about adoption? I can refer you to an agency. Yes, that's perfect. We're in. We? JT, you broke up with me. Yeah, but I'm still the father. If you decide to keep this baby, then it becomes my problem, too. So do you want me to refer you to an adoption agency or not? Yes. No. Sounds like you have a problem. like Megan and Madison. And just like our favorite royal primate, Princess Eight wears, and she'll be coming up next, so stay tuned. Cut, reset. I didn't say reset, reset. Not... Hey, Tobes, what are you doing here? Surprise, surprise, I forgot. We were supposed to catch Clown Academy tonight. Sorry, brain fart, I totally forgot. I'm due at the pharmacy. Two jobs, school, pregnant ex. No wonder your brain's flatulent. Well, there's two solutions to my problems, my carefree friend. Mochaccino and adoption. Adoption? Wow, you uh, sure Liberty will go for that? She's 15. It's the only thing that makes sense. OK, JT, let's do it. Right, uh, okay, well, take two. I'm gonna go continue to make a complete dink of myself. Okay, and roll tape. Rolling. <sighs> I tell you guys to get a room, but you have a room, which also happens to be my room. Well, tonight your room is all yours because Craig is taking me to see a band. It's friend of friends. It's nothing special. I thought we were studying. Unless, I mean, it's not really a date if you want to tag along. Yeah. Almost persuasive, but I'll pass. Come on, Emma. It's totally cool. It's totally third wheel, Craig. You guys are a couple, and I'm just me. Plus, I have a hot date tonight. It's a very sexy ride. Hey, uh, you sell glitter glue? What can I say? Your craft work on television, it uh, inspires me. You know, I can't help but wonder why a guy who's going to school is working so many hours. You in some kind of trouble, stock boy? Don't you have someone else to bug? Just saying. You need money, talk to me. I've got all sorts of creative solutions. Well, I can do without your brand of creativity. Put that back.
all of it. Whatever you say, Nark. Jazz combo or raising money for cancer research? Fighting cancer, excellent choice. Now, if only we could stomp out jazz in our lifetime. Hitting the pavement for a cancer-free world, too? Yeah, you mean one without you in it. If you need a victim for your next exploitation flick, keep looking. My mom took my camera. I'm completely unarmed. Look, if we're both going to be on the relay committee, maybe we should start over. Maybe you can get out of my way. Hey. Mr. Mochaccino fix? My grandma decided the house needed vacuuming at 6 a.m. <laughs> Tell her about the baby yet? No. She needs more to worry about. Hey, Liberty. Here, I got you some, uh, some ginger tea. It's supposed to help with the morning sickness. Oh, that's sweet. Thank you. Um, have you thought about, you know, like, options or, or life plans? Not really. Listen, do you realize what having a kid means? I mean, for your future, it's just not logical. JT, I don't want to argue, okay? Okay, well, just let me help you, okay? I have an ultrasound at two. Come with me. Before we continue, does anyone have an announcement to make? About, say, himself being an up-and-coming TV star, big hit with the kids, on every day at three? Mr. Simpson, please don't. Please. People, our next unit of media immersion is preschool television. Watch closely, because we're going to learn from a master. Gobble, 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 gobble. It's almost Thanksgiving, and today we are going to be making none other than a turkey. Gobble, 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 gobble. But before we make our turkeys, I'm going to need my handy dandy little helpers. Where are my handy dandy little helpers? There they are. So now let's make our turkey. That is girl. so cute. Come on, She's over right. Here. Why didn't you tell okay. me about this? So first of all, You've always wanted to be on TV, and there you are. Yellow construction paper. Here you go. So, uh, do you want to tell her, or should I? Okay, I'll tell her. Well, no, 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 you tell her. You tell her. It's too I good. I want to tell you her. You go. have to tell her. No, no, go. Okay. No, do it. Do it. Okay. Yeah. okay, okay. So, <clears throat> Craig and I, we met this really cute guy, and he's totally your type. Well, cute is my type. His name is Derek. He's a basketball buddy of Jimmy's. He's in grade 10, but he's all right. Hey, Derek. Weird. Weird. I mean, it's it's cosmic. We were just talking about you. Amazing. You'd think it was a setup. Derek, um, this is my single friend, Emma. Did I mention that she's single? Hey, Emma. Um, these guys were telling me that your parents just go to Degrassi? Pretty weird, eh? It's a magical story. I'll tell you all about it Friday. Uh, Friday? Like at night? It's a date. How does he or she look? I don't know. I can't. JT, please. It, it looks real.
past with flying colors, like mother, like offspring. I'll be happy to hear that at the adoption agency. Really? You sure? No, I don't want to give our baby up, but you do, obviously. Liberty, it's not that easy. We have lives ahead of us. School and jobs. So? We can do it. All of it. What was that for? Because you needed it? Look, I love you, JT. And whatever you want to do, I'm fine with it. Let's keep this baby. Bright and early as requested. Who wants muffins? Carrot muffins, your favorite. Good morning, Mrs. Kinney. Oh, Liberty, I am so happy you've taken this one back. Luck of the Irish, he's caught. <laughs> We're both very lucky. Speaking of which, um, we have great news. We're having a baby. <laughs> you can't be serious. Yeah, we are. We're going to be uh, parents. James Tiberius, do you have any idea what it takes to raise a child? You are far, far too young. Well, I thought that you could help us. I mean, you raised mom and me. And I'm not planning to spend my retirement going through it again. Have you thought about adoption? Uh, we've considered it, but no. Look, Grandma, we love each other, okay? That's all that matters. And the rest we'll figure out. The way your father figured it out, by leaving you and your mother when the going got rough. Not like him. Not at all. Let's go. Emma, hey. Okay, look. We're both going to be on the Relay for Life committee. Don't you think we should be a little bit more civilized? It's a cancer run, not a tea party. No videotaping Manny was stupid, but she asked me to do it. She was drunk Here. and very persuasive. And you emailing it to your friends makes it right? No, of course not. Pledge forms for all your fabulous cancer-fighting friends and family members. Leave no wallet untapped. Look, I shouldn't have never gone for Manny. You, on the other hand, major catch. Smart, funny, insanely gorgeous. What makes you think I'm interested? We care about things, important things. Maybe I heard that once you were kind of into me. OK, uh, butts in the bleachers, people. We'll go over the route. There's a movie tomorrow night, 7.30, Cinema 3. It's supposed to be funny. I'll be there. Don't hold your breath. Whenever you're ready, curing cancer can always wait. JT, please don't make me do this. Liberty, we can't keep avoiding this, OK? We have to tell your parents. After what happened with your grandma? So she didn't take it so well. That's nothing, JT. OK, your grandma's a lamb. My parents are lions. Well, Liberty, you're their daughter. Maybe they'll understand. It's not my mother. It's my father. He'll kick me out, guaranteed. <sighs> well, let him, OK? Because we're going to get our own place. You, me, and the baby. You're serious? I guess I could use my spelling bee money. Yeah. And I'll, I'll take more shifts at the pharmacy, and I'll quit the TV job. Oh, JT, you can't. No, I have to, because it, 
doesn't pay. And besides, they can just get someone else to make tiaras. It's fine. So, we're not telling them? No, not yet. Because before we jump, we better have a safety net. <laughs> Will you live out where the street ends in the basement apartment with one of your friends and the tap drips all night, water torture in the sink? The furnace is burning, but it's still cold, I think. The toaster sticks, and the empties are piled. I haven't been up the stairs in a while now. I gotta wash the sheets on my bed. I gotta watch those things that go unsaid. God, I wish we'd leave it at. Manny and Craig been friends for long, or...? Uh, Manny forever, Craig for a while. Hmm. Check it. Is that Grover Smash? I think it is. Who is Grover Smash? Only half the Leopard Twins. Tag team? Oh, wrestling. Jess won the belt. Which obviously means squat to you. What about TV? What do you watch? Um, mostly Brides Had Revisited on DVD. I read the book. Oh, uh, cool. You know, some wrestlers have their own books too. Comic books. That's how I got into wrestling. Reading comics when my dad took me hunting. Dude, until you have tasted fresh venison, you have not lived. I'm a vegetarian. Oh, so do you eat chicken or? Derek, um, listen, I had a great time. Well, an okay time. Actually, I had a pretty lame time, so let's just put what we're behind. Sorry. <laughs> Three-quarter inch pipe, lots of pressure. The laundry's in the basement. I can't wait to do our own laundry. And it's so close to the school. It's perfect. Is it perfect? It's perfect. Well, rent 750 a month, kids, and I'll need first and last up front. Two months rent? That's $1,500. Yeah, uh, it's pretty standard practice, kids. Uh, I can give you a minute to think about it. can't afford it. No five-finger discount this time, promise? Believe me, they do not pay me enough to stop you. So I saw some new reject on TV today, trying to keep kids from eating glue. He poached your show. No. That job didn't pay, and this one does. Ah, uh, well, this is where the big bucks are, right? Yeah, minimum wage. I'm a real tycoon. Your problem, stock boy? Tunnel vision, OK? You need money? Just get creative. Jay, spare me the lame-ass scheme. Shut up and listen. Look, you have behind-the-counter privileges where the good stuff is. You ever heard of oxycodone? It's a painkiller. I know people who'd be willing to sell their mothers to get their hands on the stuff. And you got it. Right back there. Buckets of it. Emma, over here.
You can cancel the bulk. I have a new girlfriend email. I have been planning to see this movie for weeks. <laughs> of course. Classic tale of triumph over adversity. Who knew Clown Academy had a football team? <laughs> We're cheerleaders. <laughs> For the record, when the lights go down, your hand stays in your own popcorn bag. On probation. Gotcha. So, should I draw a line down the center of the armrest, or what? Yep. Line's moving. No more talking. 